Hi guys, this is me with Holly Works Out in Life. I totally made like the best vlog ever and I recorded it upside kind of down. So yeah, anyways, um, I'm in the bathroom because because um, it's pretty dark out due to uh, it still being the winter season and I uh, don't have really that good lightning. So we're going to do it in here. So yeah, hopefully the sun. But hopefully the winter goes away and the summer could come out or spring. Hopefully spring's come out first and the summer and blah blah blah. You get no head goes. But anyway, I have I am having a fantastic day. I went job hunting and I mean not I went well first I went apartment hunting because um me and my roommate Josh, we are actually going to go out and move from this apartment that we're in now and go into a uh, another location. We don't know where yet. We're still debating. There's one apartment couple that I really love. Check if this just go for with. But you know, let's see how that works. And um I am uh going to I'm going to have I have a I already have one job already and I have a another job interview with another different whole company set. And that's the best to be tomorrow, but it's going to be Thursday due to, you know, me not having a car, I have to take the bus. So a friend of a friend is going to take me. So I'm really excited about that. And I know I was nervous at the beginning, but I feel more confident just because of nice customer service. And dude, customer service, I can do that because that's like mostly my whole life was customer service. Because I was in culinary arts and I was in uh, Alfred Kirby and, you know, as you guys know, you guys been with me long enough, you should know those things if you haven't watched those vlogs. Anyways, uh, yeah, I've been really fortunate and really, really blessed to be where I'm at now. And I just feel like this whole year for me is going to be awesome and fantastic. I'm not looking at my parents anymore being like more independent. And maybe one day I'll have my own car, my own apartment, and see how things go. Just because, like, I do desire to be independent. Hopefully, since I know the future, I will be. So, uh, yeah. And I have a little puppy. Well, I don't want a puppy, because that's too much of a hassle. I can't probably train a dog to save my life. Maybe I'll get, like, an older dog. That'd be awesome. Just because he can take care of himself. But, yeah, and, uh, I want a pit bull. English people. But anyways, um, yeah, I'm happy. I'm so happy. I'm so excited. Uh, yeah, I just things are going up and up for me, and uh, seeing things are more in a positive, more and more. I'm already positive, but I'm seeing things more in a positive er life. So yeah, things are just being really awesome, and uh, really, actually, like dropped out of Maricore. Things are just going on up and up for me. It's kind of like, yeah, you know, man. I can't complain. I'm like, really, like, nine and ten or fifteen minutes away from downtown Colorado Springs. So, you know, I love the whole downtown community. It's just awesome. And uh, people in Colorado Springs are really friendly, and you know, so hey, I feel really. Awesome, be so, it's such an awesome location, Denver, um, of Colorado, actually, to be specific. So, yeah, anyways, um, uh, just like a little thing I have to say before I go. Um, there have been some people who have been like really out there with uh, their channels, like bashing on other YouTubers to get like the views and the money or whatever they're trying to do. And in my opinion, I wouldn't really do that. I know this is YouTube I know YouTube has is a place to really be expressive and do what you want without no consequences. But I feel like there has to be consequences taken to really just for you to go out and be like that. I don't I don't really understand. I know there's like there's a fine line between having your own opinion and then just being an a, a total ass. Um, and I don't think that really, I don't think really, why would you do that, almost? I don't understand it. It's just kind of like, I think it's 
shameful, honestly. And um, and, 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 and like, I don't understand why they can't like directly email the YouTuber or talk to the YouTuber and be like, hey, your fans are out of control. Can you like handle them? I don't like. I don't. I don't. Certain YouTubers can't handle their their subscribers because due to a larger growing number, but like for my channel, it's kind of easier to say I don't have that much of a huge following. So like, you know, and, uh, I just don't understand why um, I feel like I just like say that and, and uh, why can't people can't control themselves and lash out for, you know, uh, for a person person's uh, own personal opinion. Like if I say like blah 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 sex and somebody goes to his hey do it jump like like how I do with the whole my little pony thing. I give my own two cents to it because like dude, that's my own two cents and that's what I think about the show honestly in my opinion and like, you know, of course there's some backlash due to that and you know, I didn't care. Sorry. Oh, yeah, <laughs> I just you know I didn't really understand the whole point of you being a grown man and you watching my little pony. Cause I you know I love kids shows. I love them. I you know I'm 23 and I love watching cartoons. Cause you know I don't know I'm just getting comfort from that. But like certain shows I outgrown. And uh, you know uh, sometimes I do still watch Dory Explore Blue's Clues, but I don't watch them how I used to watch them. And I tried watching My Little Pony. I couldn't do it. I couldn't make it. I was just kind of like, it was just too much happiness and little girl-ish things that were going on. It's kind of like, I need something that's more solid, more mature, something that can like chew on and feed on. I know that um, some shows are like more adult content, but they're still kid-friendly in a way. Like, um, Let's see, like SpongeBob. There's some things that are going on that kids don't know about. And I, when I was growing up, I was like, hey, yeah, it's SpongeBob. But when I'm adult, I'm just kind of like, ooh, so that's what they mean, you know? And um, there are other sh cartoons like that. So, um, yeah, I just don't feel like really my little point is giving me enough of a mature adultness for me to make it through a whole episode. Now, I know, I know there are, like, other um, things that are out there that are, like, kind of based and, like, twisted and sick, which I do enjoy because, like, that does have adult, adult content, but I just don't really agree with the whole, you know. Yeah. But, yeah. <laughs> That's what I was saying. I just don't really agree with other YouTubers bashing other YouTubers just to really make a buck. I mean, there are better ways around that. I just wish people will, like, step up their game and, you know, do something. And people may see me bashing other people, but, like, this is me getting my own twist into it. So, yeah. Anyways, my friend, if you guys know Joshua, he has a uh, giveaway on his channel. I'll post the link directly to the video. I wish you guys entered, because that would be freaking awesome, straight and sweet. So, anyways. <coughs> I'll see you guys later. Bye.